Feather 23 BHM Murphy Bed Bunkhouse weighing 5,050 pounds by Jayco here at Halet RV of Southern Michigan. Uh, we've been a Jayco dealer since actually before my time here and uh, there's a big reason for it. They just they set the gold standard for quality and, and innovation in pretty much any market you find them. So who's this camper for and why go with the J Feather and why choose Halet RV versus another place? That's what this video is about because there are a lot of good trailers out there. There really are. And uh, you know, what, what are the standout features of this one? If you have a family you want to go camping, you don't want a 32, 35 foot trailer. You just want a smaller camper to take your family out and have a good time, but you have limited towing capacity and you don't want to mess with hybrid bed ends like that one over there. This is your camper. It gives you all the benefits of a, a bigger, longer, 30 some odd foot bunkhouse in a much, much smaller package. That's what Murphy beds are for. They're two floor plans in one because you don't need to budget eight extra feet of space just for a front bedroom. Now being a Jayco, this has double the industry standard warranty, two year bumper to hitch with first year roadside assistance. And it is uh, fully vacuum laminated around the side walls, front and rear wall, as opposed to, uh, you know, common pinch lamination, which there's nothing wrong with. This is just a great hire. And, but they also laminate the front wall, the rear wall, the slide out side walls. You know, they have uh, a stronger structure, more insulation, uh, just a, a more consistent build as a result. This does have a common constructed roof and floor because there's nothing wrong with that. It's not going to really save you any weight by laminating those. It's just going to increase your cost. Um, the underbelly uh, is enclosed with a, a polypropylene wrap so that you have a moisture barrier there. You can get to the storage on the back side of the U-Dinette from that little cargo compartment right there, uh, which is nice because otherwise you have to, you know, kind of disassemble the dinette. They have just some sweet looking aluminum wheels going on this year. Little uh, Jaybird emblazoned on there. And this little lightweight is riding on an Equiflex suspension system, which is a rubber shock dampener. What that's going to do is just give you a uh, superior ride and less stress and abuse is going to be translated from the road through your suspension into your sidewalls, your roof, your frame, your windows, everything. That's going to help increase the longevity of your RV and give you a smoother ride because it's going to be less inclined to bounce down the road and it'll just sort of smoothly uh, go down the road there. You always want proper weight distribution and hitching. That's why we have a full service center here. We do hitching, pieces, parts, financing, trade-ins, uh, trucks. If you need a vehicle to go with it, we can do that. We do everything here guys um you know if you got a horse trailer and you want to trade it in on this we do that too we do everything so there are some options present here in this camper that are not standard like for instance we bumped up to the nice looking aluminum wheels we added the rear bumper grill out here so you got an area to cook for the kids and not have to heat up the interior of the camper there's there's some niceties going on here uh so the uh one touch power running is really slick you can just push the button you don't even have to be outside if the the weather turns south on you you don't have to go outside and, and get soaked in the rain to put your awning in. It's just easier. Uh, we have an outside TV station here. Uh, there's, a, there's a nice bracket I probably should have mounted on here, but you can leave a TV mounted on a bracket that latches onto this thing right here, plugs in, and now you've got an outdoor TV area with your Furion speaker system right under your power awning. So everything's just simpler that way. Now, uh, this has, uh, of course, I left that door closed, but that's your bathroom right there. So you've got a, a direct bathroom access point so that you're not tracking dirt through the whole trailer. Plus, we've got a little sink here where we can wash our hands. We've, uh, you know, the kids' space is right here. You can maybe leave some coats and stuff in this little closet. We'll see more of that inside. But also, these doors are strutted so that they don't fly open. If the kid, I mean, the, when the kid, the kids are a powder keg. The kids are fireballs. They're going to be flying out this door. They're going to fling the door open. That strut will keep your awning from getting smashed by the kids coming out the door. And it's this level of premeditation that has always enhanced my confidence with the Jayco brand. I'm a big fan. Now, there's, I, you know, when I camp, it tends to be in a little Jayco. You know, I, I'm not necessarily necessarily opposed to other brands. I think there's plenty of good campers out there. There's a few I don't like. That's not what this is about though. My point is the better warranty, the smarter user-friendly features, the anti-damage features they built into this thing. That's what I've always liked about these. Um, now as we come inside here, one thing I want to point out real quick, this is the um, copper interior decor. The next one we have in stock can be, maybe, probably will be different fabric tones. So if the only thing you dislike about this is just some fabrics or something, give us a call. 
Chances are, if we don't have one in stock uh, in a different tone, we're going to get one in stock. And if you're ever curious how much one of these runs, if you're just on YouTube down here, it says click for price and availability. That will take you to our, our list of Murphy bed campers. It'll show you what we have in stock and how much that one is and how much it weighs and how long it is and what the tank capacities are one click away. And, uh, you know, if we don't have it in stock, just give us a call and we can let you know what that info may be. Um, so we've got uh, the big u dinette in the slide here, which opens up this living space. And this is another advantage of Murphy beds. You get this awesome big living room that your family can actually be in and really enjoy uh, without the beds eating up floor space. Now, there is storage below the entire dinette. The sides, they use these easy slide totes so you can get to that storage quick and easy. There is one over there as well. Um, and remember that out there, the, the rear side storage you can get to it from inside but you can also get to it directly from the outside this is a uh, freestanding elliptical table so this can slide over to be island kitchen space you can flip it down to use it like a coffee table up front you can take it outside like a picnic table you can do whatever you want it also folds down to be your sleeper here it's just it and being freestanding if you're a bigger fellow like me who you know can uh smack his belly a little bit more than I probably should be able to, then you, uh, you know, you can always cheat the table and scoot it over to your tiny little five-year-old daughter. <laughs> uh, big, big uh, window here, and, and all the windows are going to open for ventilation in this. That's another really nice benefit. So up front here, this is kind of the, the business end of the trailer. This is where all the action can happen. So we've got normal like bedroom style his and hers wardrobe closet. So they put a shelf in there so that uh, you know you can really double up on your use of that storage. They have uh, you know personal drawers on both sides of the bed to give you maximum space there. And here is exactly how hard it is to do these Murphy beds. It takes one hand and it takes about 10 seconds even with me yakking on. And that's about all there is. Now check this out. This is a serious mattress. This is about, you know, your normal mattresses are about this thick. This is 50% thicker than standard. This is a Simmons actual residential grade mattress. And look how quick and easy that is to convert this from a, uh, a front living room with lots of big space to a front bedroom. And you've got a little privacy curtain there for you. Um, the, uh, the whole point here is unlike a hybrid where, you know, you have very little privacy you have uh very little uh, insulation that and sound dampening from inside versus outside we've got a fully enclosed travel trailer guys we've got a front bedroom we've got a big living room we've got a bunkhouse we've got a direct entry bathroom that is this trailer does a lot in a small amount of space it really gets the job done well and when you're done with it it's just as easy to put away I'm not a big muscle-bound freak. I'm a skinny arm computer nerd. You know, that's all I got going for me in this world is my ability to yak on and my sense of humor, uh, which you may or may not enjoy. I don't know. Good kitchen space going on here, too. Lots of good storage. And this is kind of one of those spaces that was a little tricky to show you just, uh, um, you know, in a uh, still picture. There's some access points down here to, like, pumps and things they don't want kids getting to. That's why they panel that off. Overhead doors are strutted here for just easy access. Once again, slides, your 18 gallon per hour water heater controls are here. It's gas and electric. You can run them simultaneously for fast recharge. That's another best in class feature. Stuff like this. All the lights being on one switch. You don't usually get that in a smaller lightweight class. We have a no crank antenna. This new antenna system has like double the range of things that were previously on the market. This wine guard system has like a 50 mile range. You're gonna get more channels, more clarity, less less being frustrated by your tv can't tell you how many times we'd sell a perfectly fine working trailer and people call and say my antenna doesn't work no you're just camping too far away from where there's signal and there's no way to tell that this is going to really help them eliminate that problem the tv is going to be included most of the time we like to add a tv to these but check this out it's on a nice double jointed swing arm so that you can make this thing face exactly where you want whenever you want it um, AM, FM, CD, DVD system down here, so all of your entertainment's in one easy location. Uh, unlike a lot of Murphy beds, this does still have a full-size fridge and freezer, full six cubic foot. That is another nice little uh, feature there. Um, getting a different look, we saw this kind of from the outside, but here's a way better look at it. Your uh, And sorry about that, battery died on me. Quick battery swap and we're back in action. So the rear bunk space back here, you see that the kids have their own storage space. We've got three more of these full extension plywood constructed uh, ball bearing glide uh, operated drawers here. Again, nice hardware you can actually get your hands on. We've got like a, a nice dedicated little like say you could fold up put sweaters or jeans there. We've got a hanging closet by the back door and uh, each bunk, each bunk has its own 
uh, personal little privacy light that'll be behind the curtain so you don't uh, interrupt anybody else. And every sleeping space has its own little power outlet system and uh, little stand here. So at night, if we need a place to, uh, you know, set our devices to charge and have our own little slice of heaven on rainy days, this is going to be a godsend. And these are 300-pound rated bunks, by the way. That's another best-in-class feature. Um, again, the bathroom is right across from the entry door. And they angle that toilet purposely so that you have a little more leg room in here. And that's a foot flush, so you don't need your face near your business. Um, we have both the power ceiling vent fan here as well as a big fifth wheel size skylight to give you some more light in here. And they do panel off the shower wall so that shower water doesn't damage your own side walls here. Um, you know, this is uh, other than just in front of the dinette where they have that floor flush slide out. They do have uh, basically a carpetless floor plan. This is extremely easy to keep clean. And if you remember... Uh, if you saw from the outside, there is a second sink right here. So you don't need to use the kitchen sink to wash your hands after using the bathroom. So you're not going to get any sort of cross-contamination problems. Again, it's that extra level of intelligence and premeditation that goes in here. Now check this out. Even down here, the, the bathroom ceiling light is down here where the kids can get to it. So so smart. You can tell this is built by someone that has kids and go camping. That is what I like about Jayco's. They actually have uh, a couple people. Their, their job title is called the Campsite Auditor. They, they'll pull trailers randomly off the line for quality control purposes, but they don't just fire the appliances. They pretend to camp in it. They'll actually cook lunch in the RV and test it. That to me is so super cool because that means that there's someone actually saying, okay, we, we can build it this way on paper, but does it make sense in real life? That's where practice and theory can be different, and that's the Jayco advantage. So give us a call, 800-256-5196, Haylet RV of Coldwater, Michigan. Take care, everybody. Stay safe, have fun, and happy camping.